All right, what is going on guys? Today we are watching Summertime Rendering Season 1, Episode 18. In the last episode, uh, we had a few things happen. Uh, firstly, Shinpei got some rest. Thank fucking God. It's apparently, in regards to his loops, um, it meant that he, because he was looping pretty much every day, he wasn't getting any sleep. Probably hadn't slept in like a week. My man needed that sleep. Looked energized as fuck after that. Even if his body was kind of reverting back to the same state, his brain was still kind of awake basically all that time, which must be exhausting. Um, and then we had uh, the part with Nezu, where uh, him and Ushio went back to his house. We found out that his wife had been turned into a shadow, or, well, a shadow was made of his wife. Um, and he got his much needed closure by uh, popping her. Um, so respect to Nezu for that. Really unfortunate kind of situation, especially considering it was only a few months back as well, um, from what he said. And then uh, we ended off the episode whilst I was talking about it in the episode, which, fucking hell, we haven't seen this priest in a while, have we? Then, boom, shows up at the end of the episode. So we're going to speak to him this episode. We're going to find out some stuff, maybe. Um, but overall, they're going to try and get the festival cancelled. wonder how they're going to do it. I mean, surely just pop an Ushio out the watch would probably be a big, helpful start. But we will see. Um, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. It means so much um, for everybody showing the sport on the channel and it helps me grow as a creator as well and let's go into this episode right now oh there was a drought a few hundred years back oh this is Heine damn okay yeah I figured he wasn't a shadow he still could be in cahoots with them, though. Bro, it's hot as shit in the UK right now. I fucking hate it. Surely it'd be hotter in Tokyo with, like, uh, pollution and stuff. Big cities, you know? What are these funky questions he's asking him? And bro's a gamer? Okay. <laughs> Final Fantasy VII Remake? Nice. Oh, he's a young buck. I like how we're just having chats about Final Fantasy and Summertime Rendering. Swamp Man 4's experiment? What is that? <laughs> like, oh, there's a random bullshit chat he's just entertaining. Like, yeah, yeah, Shinpei came to see me and asked me a fucking bunch of questions. <laughs> Interesting theory. Might not be a god at all, it could be just an extraterrestrial. Oh, man's got the friggin' glowy glasses. This ain't good. That's an interesting theory of how shadows came to be, so they've been here for so long. Just get Ushio out the watch, bro. Oh, shit. Hey, fucking yo! He's 300 years old? But he's not a shadow. How is this possible? Wait, what? Oh, shit. Oh, my God. That's messed up. So, this is... But she said that he wasn't a shadow. What? What the hell? I'm hella confused. I don't get how he's lived this long then. If he's Shide. Damn, I did not know the priest was going to be this relevant in the story. 
bothers me on a biological level. <laughs> so how is he 300 years old? What the hell? Oh, so they're related to the priest as well then, right? What? Oh, wait, isn't that... Wasn't that his daughter? I'm hella confused, bro. Oh, so it's not the same person. It's just every time a baby is born, he looks exactly the same. That's insane. That is fucking gross. What the hell? So that right there is an empty corpse as all the memories and shit had been transferred to the baby. But yeah, I mean, I guess it's technically the same person. It's just a different meat meat pouch. <laughs> different body. But the same body. Oh, it's confusing. I would be blowing this dude's fucking brains out right now. Oh, shit. Bro, this motherfucker is evil, evil. Oh, look at that face. That is evil. Look at that face. Kill him. I can shoot him in the head. You're aiming for his chest. Shoot him in the neck. Um, head. But this is different. This is a human. Technically. Is it though? Is it? Bro, just kill him. Ujo zaps away the body. No evidence. Easy. Easy do. Yeah, legit. Shinpei, come on. Shoot him. Oh, fuck. Shinpei, please kill him. Oh, shit. And it didn't kill him. Or did it? Oh, black shit came out. What is that? Is he dead? Surely not. Yeah, yeah let me check his pulse. <laughs> Bro, he was about to snap you in half. Shinpei, you were lacking there, bro. Let's go, Ushio. What the hell? Oh, I thought it was someone naked. Uh, did she just stab her? Oh, he made a shadow. No fucking way. Bro, Shinpei, br blow your fucking brains out. Shoot yourself. Shoot yourself. Oh, Shinpei. Bro, this motherfucker is evil. Isn't it not a big deal if he dies before Ushio, though? That's why he should have shot himself. Bro, this is a fucking good villain, but my god, is he evil. Why didn't... Uh, why didn't Ushio recognize another thing standing there? Bro, this situation is messed up. Did she shoot? Oh, damn! Fucking Avengers assemble, let's go. God damn. I don't even know what he has to do in this situation. This is fucked up. He's gonna go back, but is Ushio gonna be there? Oh no, she- No, she's not there! Bro, he's bleeding from his fucking eye. No, that is the cliffhanger of the year! Oh my god! Fuck! There's no way the episode ended like that. Holy shit. I don't even know what to say. That- Ooh, this priest freaking needs to go.
everything about that situation was so confusing to me. Like, so basically the thing that was sliced in half by the head was a shadow. And then the thing that killed Lucio was the priest human original with his goddamn shadow armor, Shide shadow armor. I think. Um, God damn, Ushio. If, oh, Shinpei, I know he was like angry and like flustered and probably couldn't think properly, but if he'd killed himself faster than Ushio would have died right there, would, would that have resolved it? I don't know, but I mean, he, he's not a hyper intelligent being, so he, 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 he messed up. Uh, I don't know if Ushio is going to be able to come back from this. I have no freaking clue what's going to happen in the next episode. Holy shit, am I excited for it though. Yeah, I thought the priest was going to play a part in this story. I did not realize it was going to play this much of a part. Uh, kind of a weird situation, considering I, Heine, or the child that became Heine, is, was, was the priest child or is it just a child that he knew? Either way, I had to mate with a child very gross but um yeah overall a very good episode and i'm definitely looking forward to the next anyway guys i want to thank you guys so much for watching this episode have a nice rest of your day and peace out